Today, I am wearing a spring-summer linen dress by Zimmerman. My shoes are Balenciaga from The Real Real. Thank you, Italo Jewelry, for sponsoring this video. I really wanted to showcase their beautiful pieces because when you're traveling or when you are afraid to wear some of your original diamond pieces, these pieces are a wonderful substitute. Today I am wearing a gorgeous tennis bracelet style necklace, bracelet, and gorgeous earrings. These are very high quality sapphire stones that are uniquely designed and extremely well priced, but they are also set in sterling silver. Why spend a fortune when you can get the exact same look with these brilliant looking stones? I especially love the earrings because they are great to wear around town and I don't have to worry about losing one of them. Finally, if you are watching this program, you can get a special 20% discount. All of the information is going to be below in the description box so you too can get these beautiful, gorgeous, brilliant shining pieces. And don't forget to use my code NT20. Welcome to one of the most luxurious hotels in the world, the Miramar in Montecito, California. There isn't a hotel that I enjoy more than the colonial vibes and architecture that this hotel represents. Upon entering, you are greeted by the Harlequin pattern floors which are made of black and white marble. The center soffit of the ceiling is rounded and below that is a gorgeous crystal chandelier, reminiscent of old Hollywood. I truly enjoy walking down these steps as I honestly believe that I am in an old Hollywood movie. The railings are thin, the handle is brass, and everything is in scale. Beautifully designed as if it were on this property for decades. The ottoman is tufted and two Chesterfield chairs are seen in the background against a beautiful paneled wall. It is not unusual to find a Chagall lithograph in this hotel as Caruso, who is the developer and owner of this property, really collects gorgeous fine art. Stepping into the grand room, you are greeted with chevron wood floors that are absolutely stunning and of course a fireplace that is on 24 hours a day. Above the ceiling has gorgeous soffit details in the shape of diamonds and again reminiscent of an old Hollywood period. The furniture is traditional but very minimal and soft. The colors are muted, the blue-gray walls juxtaposed by white painted paneling makes everything pop. A bunny fun artwork is seen on the wall along with modern art reminiscent of David Hockney. Everything has been carefully curated and of course there's a gorgeous black lacquer grand piano sitting in the corner of this gorgeous room. My absolute favorite door in this property is the door into the private walnut paneled bar. This bar is fantastic and the door is even better. The architectural plans, as you can see from Paul Williams, are on the walls from an era long gone. Homes in Beverly Hills that were designed by this famous architect who also actually designed the Los Angeles airport. I took a moment's repose in what looks like a Missoni sofa, which is really fun with gorgeous soffited, and not to mention the paneled moldings made of walnut wood that surround this entire room. I sat down to order a drink and loved the mid-century lights that sit on top of the bar. 
and the cocktails are absolutely delicious. The loggia is also equally welcoming and has very comfortable seating in what looks like men's suit fabric. The fireplace is also made of copper and has a nice presence. This area is also right outside of the great room, which allows you to see the ocean views and be able to have a cocktail in what looks like a 1960s Hollywood home. The gathered fabric ceiling detail in the canopy of the loggia is a very special touch and again, very much inspired by Paul Revere. The iron details are also very much reminiscent of the period. As you can see, they are very minimal, they are dainty, and that is what really sets them apart. The stained glass harlequin pattern, the crystal chandeliers, everything reflects upon the other surfaces to create the Hollywood glamorous vibe that Caruso wanted to achieve in his property. The eating area has low mid-century chairs. You'll often find a walnut table that's oval mixed in with the square tables, which is very much reminiscent of an actual residence. And the walls are paneled with gorgeous chinoiserie. Again, the pop of modern art really brings this property together. We are giving you unprecedented access to one of the most exclusive hotels in the world. We are, again, at the Miramar Rosewood Hotels, a five-star hotel designed by Caruso. Caruso, as you well uh, might know, is a huge developer from Las Vegas to California to all of his properties in Texas. So this hotel is extremely special and we do have something very important going on right now. We have the Dior Summer Exhibit. So follow me into this adorable Christian Dior collab right here happening this summer at the Miramar Hotel. One of the suites at the Miramar Hotel, as I mentioned, has been turned into the Dior Summer Collaboration. Everything that is in this beautiful suite is actually from Christian Dior. From the needlepoint pillows to the toile wallpaper, and of course, all of the cushions and fabric and products you see in here. I tried on some of the Dior handbags and sunglasses and was mesmerized by all the outdoor items that Christian Dior is actually offering at this moment. From ping pong paddles to hammocks to towels and lots and lots of fun items that you can use in your home for a summer refresh. What's really incredible about this hotel and what makes it stand out and really makes it a unique property is that it has direct access to the beach. There is a wonderful restaurant right at the beach that belongs to the property and you have private access to the beach that belongs to the Miramar Hotel. If you're not a beach person, you can certainly go to the pool and enjoy their cabanas. Thank you for joining me on this very fun episode of Red Elevator. I hope you enjoyed the travel with me episode here. If you want to see more travel series and you want to see more hotel inside looks and peaks, do sound down below. I read everything you guys um, write about and I want to make sure that I'm giving you the content you're looking for. So do let me know if you enjoyed this episode. Make sure and give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And I can't wait to see you guys again here on the Red Elevator next week.